Hey guys, what's up? It's Catherine. Welcome to today's video. Today is the long-awaited room tour in my new house. You guys have been asking like crazy for a room tour ever since I moved in. I feel like my room is finally like put together exactly how I want it. Pretty much everything that I want in the room is hung up, organized the way that I love it. I love my room. It's like the coziest vibe ever. I've never felt so at home in a space. I'm very happy with how everything came together. So if you guys are new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. Today's video is actually sponsored by LUL. Huge shout out to them for helping me out and sending me this mattress. You guys know that I just moved into a new house. Moving is so incredibly expensive. I did have to downsize from a king bed to a queen because my space here is so much smaller than my original living space. My room is only 10 by 10 here and I think at my old space it was at least five feet more for both. It was a much larger space that I had. So I'm so happy to be working with Lul on today's video. We actually own two Lulls in my house now. My mom has a Lul. She absolutely loves it. I've slept on it a few times um, when, she, when we didn't live together and I used to go visit her. So love the mattress. Um, you guys will see the whole process of unboxing and all of that kind of stuff, how it works if you guys have never seen um, LOL or heard about them. They're basically like a mattress in a box and it expands. Um, one single person can do it all by themselves. So um, I will have a lot more info about that at the end of the video if you guys want to check that out. All the links that you guys need down below to check out LOL um, will be there. So without further ado, let's go ahead, hop right into today's video. If you guys have any questions or anything, go ahead and leave them in the comments down below. I always do my best to respond to all of them. All right, let's get started. I hope you guys enjoy. So when you first walk into my bedroom, we just have this door right here. We have the light switch and then up above this light switch, I just have this adorable little dollar section find at Target. It's just a little black round mirror. I love it. I eventually would love to put a little shelf right underneath here, but love this little entry section of my room. So then moving along, we have some frames and my TV. So these frames are both from Ikea. They're just their regular white frames. So in this one, I just have a printout that says you have it in you to do whatever the hell you want. And I love that saying, very empowering. So we have that over there. The lighting is kind of blocked by my TV right now. Um, and then I just have a Samsung smart TV. Love it. And then I have my cords hidden by these cord hiders from Amazon. They are fantastic. I eventually would love to put the cords up behind my TV. So as you guys can see, it's kind of like out. Um, so I'd love to have a switch or not a switch, an outlet behind the TV. So I don't have to have these cords kind of hanging down like that anymore. So then moving on to this side, we have this frame and print. The print is from Loft Eau Decor. I have had this print literally since I like first started YouTube. Kind of crazy. So <laughs> love that. Then moving on, we just have my window, kind of a small window, kind of like weirdly sectioned in this room. I don't know why they couldn't put it in like the center of it, but anyway, I mean, it all works out. It's quite nice. All right, let's zoom back in here. So we have my window with the window coverings are from TJ Maxx, actually Home Goods, I believe, maybe both. Um, but I found both of those at like Home Goods, TJ Maxx kind of stores. I love them. And then I also have the paper blinds at the top, as you can kind of see. Um, and then just the see-through kind of sheer curtains. And I love it. Lots of good amount of light in. Um, and then it also kind of blocks a good amount of light when you put the paper shades down. So I have them up so I can film and show you guys everything in beautiful natural light right now. All right, so I don't really have anything in this corner yet. I'd love to get a basket over there and put my extra pillows and linens, like blankets and stuff over there. So it's not just kind of like an empty space, but for now that's what it is. So then moving on to this corner over here, we just have my nightstand. The nightstand itself is from TJ Maxx. I love it. I was very inspired by one of my friends who also had these in her room. Um, so I just have this little nightstand and then on top we just have some, you know, 
essential kind of things. So the marble tray is from Target. The candle that we have over here is from Bath and Body Works flannel candle from last season. And then I just have my Echo Show back there in the corner. I had to turn on my little salt lamp for you guys. I got the salt lamp for $10 at TJ Maxx. I have this little white coaster that says California on it. And then I also have my Shungite plate right here for my phone. I set that on my phone every night. Shungite plates are great to kind of block all the EMF waves and everything from your phone, um, especially having it right next to my head when I sleep. I love being able to place that right there and then i have my tv remote up there as well and then this just has a nice little drawer so in here i just have like my normal essentials <laughs> things that i would need um bedtime i guess um i love this body cream it's been super dry lately so my hands have been like super dry at night and i love just putting um some lotion on right before i go to bed um i just have some ibuprofen these are my favorite stress vitamins my lip sleeping mask for nighttime. I can also light this candle for you guys because I didn't do that before I started this video and I should have. All right, we will try it right handed then. <laughs> there we go. And candles lit. All right, so this little lighter I got from Dollar Tree. Um, yeah, just have like basics like that in there. So that is my nightstand. Love it. Now we're all cute with the candle, all the cozy vibes. I love it. I am obsessed. Then moving on, we have the main statement piece of my room, which is my bed and my bed frame. So this beautiful bed is from Lul. They gifted me this mattress. I am obsessed. I'll kind of show you guys the little process here of me opening it, unwrapping it, stuff like that. I love their mattress so, so much. I will also include a little... Um, clipped at the end of the video of like the full-on process of everything if you guys are interested go ahead and stay tuned for that so then my bed frame itself is from ikea it's just the white malm bed frame this is the queen size love it let's go ahead and zoom out we got all the cozy vibes here i'm obsessed so the three euro pillows in the back are from ikea with just some ikea covers i used to have a king size bed which is why i still have those three so when i downsize because as you guys can see this room is hey pretty small as it is it's uh 10 by 10 in total so i had to make the best use of the space so we had to downsize my king to a queen which is why i got a new mattress in the first place so I still have my three euro pillows that are back there and then my two um, standard queen size pillows. So the linens that I have on my pillows are from Amazon. They are the best freaking linens you will ever sleep on. If you guys like silky, like slippery sheets, you'll love those. So I will go ahead and leave those linked down below if you guys want to check those out too. Um, and then my bedding, the white duvet cover is also from Amazon. And then the two... I have two duvet covers, or not duvet, um, two, what's the word I'm looking for, you guys? Two comforters shoved inside this duvet cover. This is a king size. I didn't want to switch um, and buy up all new linens because the king size honestly just fits perfectly with a queen bed. I mean, it is a little big, but I kind of like the oversized look on it. So the um, comforters inside are from Target. They're like the super thin summer comforters, which it's you know, coming springtime and summer. So it's actually going to work out perfectly. So I have those inside the duvet cover and then it just zips at the bottom here. And then this blanket right here, you guys would have seen on my Instagram, um, super soft and cozy. So then moving up, my favorite thing about my room is my black accent wall. This has been something that I've wanted to do in a room for so, so, so long now. And I couldn't do that at my old living situation. Uh, so we did it here and I'm obsessed with how it turned out. I wanted to keep the room super, super simple and minimal. As you guys can see, I don't really have too many things in here. Um, so the only thing I really have on this wall is this little, let me go ahead and zoom in, Lunar Phases um, art hanging on the wall. This is from Marshalls. I love it. I thought it was so cute and I think it'll literally, well, it does kind of, you know, just slightly fill out the wall. I don't know. I just love how simple it is, but I thought it matched the vibe of my room really well. The lighting from outside is totally kind of messing with it. Let me see if I can come this way. 
show you guys. There you go. Look how cute that is. It has all the little moon faces on it. And then we'll come back to this corner in a second. So moving back here, this is another one of my favorite sections of my room. I just added this shelf pretty recently. So the shelves are from Ikea. I got one of the really long shelves and then one of the super short shelves over there in the corner. Um, if you look like super closely, you can see the shelf line. But if you're far away, you can't really tell. So it honestly works out really well. Um, it just gives like a really nice focal point in the room. So let's talk about all the little fun things that I have on the shelf. So actually underneath the shelf, I have these two little signs from the Target dollar section. It says stay a while. I thought it was so cute and just kind of like added that little touch. I mean, like obviously you're going to stay a while in bed and I thought it was so cute. So I also strung some twinkly lights up over there to give like some nice mood lighting because the salt lamp that I have down there really only gives off so much light. So we added those as well. So it's like a nice, really cozy vibe, especially with like a candle going at night. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you would have seen like the full on vibes and I'm obsessed. So many of you guys DM'd me, said you loved my room. I love it, you guys are awesome. So. The actual items on the shelf, the first thing that I have is just this hanging plant from Ikea. I want to say they're like $10, they're really not that bad. I have another one of these in my bathroom and I just, I love it. It gives off like such a fun vibe, it adds some dimension to the shelf so that way it's not just all like separated if you guys know what I mean, it adds like that nice little dimension on the side. And then up here is where I keep some of my crystals. I also sell these crystals on my shop, this one is one of my favorites. This is um, rose quartz crystal. I have a little thing that I got from the Target dollar section to set it in so you can like display it um, better than just that. But I sell these on my shop. Um, and then the selenite towers, I am obsessed with these. These are like protection and stuff. Um, so I have that up here. I also sell these. And then I have my little amethyst cluster up here. I have one of these left on my shop if you guys want to check that out. It's always linked down below. Um, and then over here, I just have some room spray. I'm obsessed with this. This is the vetiver and cedarwood room spray from Target. It's like 10 bucks and comes in a cute little bottle. And then of course, you can turn it into decor just like that. All right, I'm gonna like step up on here and hopefully not hit my head on the fan while I'm trying to film this for you guys. So the little frame that I have here is from Ikea. It's one of like their super, super cheap frames, but I love how thin it is. It's a lot thinner than the other frames that I have on that side of my room. So this is just a drawing that I did. You can kind of see my reflection. Hey, what's up? Um, this is just a drawing that I did in college for one of my art classes. If you guys don't know, I have an art degree, like a graphic design degree. So um, yeah, that was one of my classes. We had to do something like that, like do a sound and I, um, you had to like pick out a sound and mine was an airplane landing. So that was what it turned into, <laughs> kind of cool. Um, and then over here, we just have another little crystal hanging out. Um, and then I have this candle from, ba not Bath and Body Works, um, TJ Maxx and Home Goods. The Sensational line is my favorite. This is the Storm Scent. It smells exactly like the blue Capri candles from Anthropology. So little life hack, if you don't want to spend tons and tons of money on them, um, I think I took off the tag. <laughs> I did. Um, but these ones, I swear I got this one for seven bucks. It's a single wick, but they have giant, giant three wick ones for like 13 bucks, like twice the size of the ones that you can buy at Anthropology. So a little life hack if you guys love that scent. The other thing that I have over here in the corner is my little sleep spray. It's kind of like far in the corner. I realized that last night, every night I'll like crawl up here and grab it and then like spritz it across my pillows and you just you sleep so much better i love it it smells so amazing so so good this is their lavender and vanilla with natural essential oils pillow mist amazing i use it all the time and i still have so much left <laughs> and then the very last little thing that i have in the corner here is just this little plant from the target dollar section i want to say it was like three bucks cute little plant so then I had a plant on, let me zoom out here, I had a plant on both sides of the shelf. We're zooming back in, taking full advantage of my phone today and filming on my phone. So that is everything up on my shelf. I am obsessed with this shelf. I just feel like it adds so much to the room while also keeping it really simple because it's all like nice little decor pieces that are all in one little section. So then we move on. 
losing track of my words here, to this corner. This is one of my favorite corners. Actually, honestly, I just love my entire room, you guys. I've, I've never lived in a place where I have felt so at home and like so in my element in my own room. So just know that I'm thriving over here and I love it. So <laughs> let's talk about this mirror. So I had a totally different arrangement in my room when I first moved in. If you guys saw all my moving vlogs, you would have seen that. But I didn't really think that I would have a ton of space for like a giant full length mirror. And honestly, I have a full length mirror downstairs in our entryway and I also have one in our office. So I didn't need like another full full length mirror, like a super tall one. Um, so I found this one at TJ Maxx. It is one that you can actually like pull out and there's like an easel kind of stand for it. So that is that, it's just got like some silver um, edging on it, super thin um, like frame, which I liked. And then the lamp back here, love it. I have an Edison bulb in there. It just adds so much fun like so many fun vibes, cozy vibes at the end of the night. Um, if I don't want to have like my actual fan on, um, I will have that on. It's just controlled by the switch. So the lamp is one that reminds me of like the one that you can find at Target. It's got a nice flat bottom. Um, it's all marble, gold decor. And then I literally haven't even taken off the tag. <laughs> it's still here. Um, this was, I want to say like 70 bucks and I feel like so many people spend so much money on these kind of lamps. They're so cute, I love them, but I found this at Home Goods for 70 versus like, you'd probably find this at like 100 plus at Target or something. All right, and then moving on, I just have my little plant hanging out. This is my faux fiddle leaf fig tree. She needs to be dusted real badly. <laughs> Can't really tell too much in this video. But I have that in a plant stand from Home Goods as well. I love it. The natural wood ties in with the wood that I have over there since those are the only two wood elements that I have in my room. But I love it. That is my room. This is my, my sanctuary, my safe space. I love it. So then moving back to the very end. Hello, you can see me again. Uh, we just have my closet, just the sliding closet. If you guys wanna see a full closet tour, I do have another video up on how I organized it and everything that's inside. So I'll go ahead and leave that linked down below for you guys. All right, so that is the final room tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Again, huge, huge thank you to Lil for sponsoring today's video and sending me a brand new mattress. Mattresses can be so incredibly expensive and I feel like sometimes it's hard to find like the right one for you. So Lil actually has a 100 night trial for their mattresses. So if you guys don't like it after 100 nights, you can easily send it back. Their customer service is great. The setup of everything Everything overall is so incredibly easy so simple so let's go ahead and run those clips so basically your mattress will arrive in a box like this one and then all you have to do is open it up the mattress is vacuum sealed and compressed into this tiny box so all you have to do is pull your mattress to your bedroom pull it out of the box um, cut off all of the plastic, kind of like unwrap it, and you'll start to see it kind of expanding already. And then the mattress is usually folded in half and then like rolled up. So you pull that out, you put it onto your um, bed frame or wherever you are keeping your mattress, and then you just go ahead and cut off the plastic and you can literally see it expand in front of your eyes. It's the coolest thing. I have had a few different mattresses, um, so it's been fun to kind of experience this all over again. It's kind of like the coolest part of it. It's a high quality mattress in a box. They have a cooling gel infused layer on the top, which is super awesome. It really doesn't take too long to set up. Your mattress is pretty much fully expanded within a day and it's super comfortable. I love it. I I've been able to settle in comfortably and feel super comfortable and cozy in the mattress within literally a month, I think is how long I've had it. Um, so yeah, I love it. I'm so happy with my mattress. If you guys wanna check it out, all of the links and everything will be down below. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. That is going to be it for today and I'll catch you guys in my next video.